morning, uh, Speaker. My question is for the Deputy Premier. Now, all we've seen from this Liberal government is one scandal after another. The recurring theme is they can never get their stories straight. During the gas plant scandal, they couldn't get their story straight on who paid Peter Feist to delete the files off the government computers. Turns out the taxpayers paid the $10,000. Now the government can't get their story straight on the Sudbury bribery scandal. First, they didn't know who paid Jerry Lougheed's legal bills. Then it wasn't the government. And now we know the Liberals paid the bills until he was charged. But the Premier stated that Jerry Lougheed doesn't speak for the Liberal Party. So my question is, uh, Speaker, why did the Liberals pay his legal fees in the first place? Question, thank you. Deputy Premier. Speaker, um, the Premier made it very clear yesterday that the government has not paid anything towards the legal bills here, Speaker. Uh, the party is not paying anything, Speaker. This is uh, an issue that's uh, in the courts, and we'll have no further comment on that, Speaker. Give us supplementary. Go ahead, officer. Well, oh, well, back to the Deputy Premier. The recurring theme with this scandal plagued government is they can never get their story straight. In the teachers' union scandal, it was a million. It was for pizzas. No, wait, it's three million. It's for negotiating. No, wait, it's for labor peace. Every single day, the story changed. Now, in the Sudbury bribery scandal, it's obvious many liberals are going to be subpoenaed by the Crown or by Mr. Lougheed's lawyers. They better get their story straight before they swear an oath, Speaker. But I'm curious. Will they be in court standing up for Ontario's taxpayers or for the Liberal Party? My question is, will the Premier and her Deputy Chief of Staff be testifying for the Crown or for the defence? Thank you. You see it, please? You see it, please? Thank you. Deputy. Uh, Speaker, we're not going to speculate on an issue that's before the courts. New questions? New questions?